The University of Alberta Faculty of Engineering is one of the largest engineering schools in Canada in terms of size, international impact, and reputation. The faculty is home to one Canada Excellence Research Chair, 16 Canada Research Chairs, 13 Natural Sciences and Engineering Research Council Chairs, and five Foundation-supported Chairs. Topic. History Engineering classes have been taught at the University of Alberta since it opened in 1908. Topic. Programs Topic. Undergraduate The undergraduate bachelor's degree program for engineering is based on a four- to five-year program. The traditional program involves taking two terms fall and winter for four years to complete a degree. The co-op program involves intermittent work placement terms, within a five-year period. Co-op programs are usually in higher demand by students than the four-year, traditional, programs, and thus the entrance GPA tends to be higher. New students to engineering must first take two terms of general engineering courses before specializing into various departments. These courses include introductory chemistry, waves and light, statics, dynamics, calculus, linear algebra, computer programming and one complementary studies elective. This is structured to give students a feel of their areas of interest and strength, before fully entering into a specialized program. It also allows for ranking each student on a level playing field to decide program admission in second year. A sixth course in each term General Engineering 100 and 101 must also be taken as an introduction to both the engineering profession, and as a means for each department to recruit students. Topic. Departments The departments in engineering at the University of Alberta are as follows Chemical and Materials Engineering including Computer Process Control and Oil Sands Options The Chemical Engineering Program is the top program in Canada by a wide margin and is in the top 5% in North America. This ranking is against 177 programs in both the U.S. and Canada. This ranking is based on total refereed publications over a five-year period as listed in the Science Citation Index of ISI. Source? Civil and Environmental Engineering including School of Mining and Petroleum Engineering Electrical and Computer Engineering including Nano Electrical and Software Options and Engineering Physics Mechanical Engineering Biomedical Engineering administered jointly by the Faculty of Engineering and the Faculty of Medicine and Dentistry. The department hosts graduate and PhD students. Each department also has a biomedical option, a program that applies engineering principles to medical practice. Topic: <laughs> Graduate All five Faculty of Engineering departments offer MSc, MENG, and PhD programs. Topic. Key research facilities The Nanofab, an open-access micro- and nano-fabrication research facility with approximately $110 million worth of state-of-the-art equipment and infrastructure. The National Institute for Nanotechnology NINT, a joint venture with the National Research Council Canada NRC, that hosts world-leading facilities and research programs involving more than 300 researchers. The Alberta Centre for Surface Engineering and Science ACSES, a $20 million multidisciplinary integrated surface characterization and modification facility. 
The Oil Sands Tailings Research Facility, a facility designed to support substantial fundamental tailings research at a pilot scale 600 and 2,000 kg solids per hour and accommodate multiple, concurrent interdisciplinary research projects. The Peter S. Allen Magnetic Resonance Research Center, a 100% research-dedicated, state-of-the-art facility located inside the University Hospital that houses 1.5T, 3T and 4.7T full-body MRI systems. Topic. Campus Faculty of Engineering facilities are located mainly in the northwest corner of the University of Alberta campus and have experienced much growth since 2001. The Joint Engineering Teaching and Learning Complex ETLC, an Electrical and Computer Engineering Research Facility ECERF, was completed in February 2002. ETLC contains the main faculty of engineering offices, several lecture halls, and many electrical and computer engineering laboratories. ECERF houses department and faculty offices as well as for lab space for graduate and postdoctoral work. The Alan P. Markin, Canadian Natural Resources Limited Natural Resources Engineering Facility NREF, was added on October 1, 2004, and houses most civil and environmental engineering programs. Most recently, the National Institute for Nanotechnology was opened in June 2006. As a joint venture between the federal and provincial governments of Canada and Alberta and the University of Alberta, the Institute houses some of the world's best nanotechnology facilities. It is Canada's quietest research space, filtering out all electromagnetic, acoustical and vibrational noise. Other facilities include the Mechanical Engineering and Chemical, Materials Engineering buildings, both of which are connected to ETLC by Pedway. A new structure, the Donadeo Innovation Center for Engineering DICE, was erected between the Chemical and Materials Engineering Building and the Windsor Car Park. The new building will provide approximately 28,400 square meters of space to support expanded educational and research activities in the Faculty of Engineering. The building houses faculty members, staff, and students from every engineering discipline. <laughs> 